Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Simply Blessed Crafts. I have a little bit of a shopping haul and a little bit of a shopping shop along with me. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, at the end will be the shopping haul. I do got to jabber a little bit at the beginning of it just because I didn't know when, how I was going to put this uh, video together. So don't mind that. Um, I mean, it is real life and I just kind of jabber a little bit. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, so uh, it isn't a whole lot. It isn't a very long video and and everything, but I hope you guys enjoy this, and give me a like down below if you enjoy it. Don't forget to subscribe and share it if this is something that you enjoy or if someone else would enjoy something like this. Um, I don't put a whole lot of content like this out, so definitely share it if this is something that you guys enjoy. And yeah, let's get into the video. So guys, just figured I would go thrifting and, uh, you know, me and my cousin decided we'd go check this stuff out and I figured I was going to do a thrift with me and I just down dawned on me that I didn't pick up the camera. So yeah, so here I am thrifting and figured I better pull up my camera because I picked up a couple things already and I haven't even showed you. So it's a little dirty. Yeah, very dirty in here. I don't even know why they didn't wash it out, but... It looked like it was used for a planner already, and I thought that would be a cute. So, definitely gotta be washed out, but very cute for spring. So, why not? And then, I don't know if any of you guys, I'm sure all of you guys follow Unicorn Dust Designs, and if you don't, go follow her. But she literally just put this up last night as a video, and look at what I found, you guys. Like... <laughs> talk about deja vu but um I had to pick it up and of course do it I mean hello and then this you guys it's two bucks it's made out of wood and very in good shape I mean granted I'm gonna have to I don't know who Deanne Goosen is but I'm gonna have to just definitely sand that off or paint it but very good shape I'm gonna have to give that a good makeover and redo for spring but it'd be a good bird feeder if anything I mean heck two bucks why not and then this is a good sign to just do over it's a welcome sign it says friends welcome sorry I am on my phone so I'm not on my regular camera and it says relatives by appointment but it's probably just gonna get redone it's just a good wood sign for for any um, you know any regular uh, wood wood sign. So I mean, I pick up any wood piece that I possibly can find for a wood sign. I mean, heck, and it's all two dollars. All of this stuff comes out of these bins here. We're at the Boys and Girls Club, and right now they have these bins out. And everything in them for or for two dollars right now. So I figured, heck, it's a heck of a deal for wood. So I picked all that stuff up, and I will try to bring out my camera for more. Right now, right now, I'm just taking a break and video for you. So I will let you know what I find. Book stacks, you guys, check that out. <laughs> my mom does too. This is my cousin, by the way, you guys. You remember Tracy? Velvet? Oh, foam. It's a lot of just digging and glass, you guys. I'm just... I got so much glass stuff, I'm just not even, I mean, I could probably get in and dig some, dig in some of these, but, unless something's really catching my eye. It's 
that. Chair here. This chair is broken on. It's missing two legs. It's cute though. Yes, you could. Those grapevine wreaths are actually really nice, Tracy, because you can use them. You can use them all year long. Yeah, that stuff definitely needs to come off of it, though. Look at these cute little things. Reminds me of like the 80s when they have like the little teddy bears sitting in them. Definitely grabbing those. Shoot, are these gonna be? Are these gonna be all together? Or are they gonna be freaking two dollars each? All right. Well, I'm quoting this. If they're two dollars each, I'm putting them back because I am not paying two dollars each for those. <laughs> that looks like a red solo cup trophy. <laughs> it does. <laughs> it's a wine glass. Look at that. <laughs> right? Ah, uh, nah. I got I got a bunch of it at home. Look at that. So, you guys, I'm not going to get it right now, but this is also something that Sammy over at Unicorn Dress Designs just did as well. And look at what I just found. I mean, I usually don't find stuff like this in my thrift stores. I thought it was just funny that two of the signs, or two of the things that you, of, uh, that Sammy just did in her videos... I've recently found. <laughs> that is amazing. <sighs> Shout out to Sammy. He has a little chip on his ear, but look at how cute he is. It's a little piggy. Looks like a piggy bank. Adorable. Look at the little bunny. Oh, 
$1.99. We might have to get him. Precious moments. We're looking for little birdies, little tiny birdies that can go in with some spring stuff. Problem is, is these shelves are loaded so much. Sometimes it's really hard to pick out the cute ones. shelves are loaded so much my mom really collects precious moments but she told me not to buy her anymore so I'm on a strict no oh my gosh look at the little chicken he still has his stoppers in him he's a salt and pepper shaker but he doesn't have his match some of these big birds but those are ugly I don't see any little birds just a couple of ugly geese which not exactly what I'm looking for Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Simply Blessed Crafts. So I have a little bit of a haul for you. Um, I'm actually gonna show you a little bit of a haul and then I'm gonna show you me going shopping for the stuff that I picked up, if you were interested in that. Or maybe I've showed you the haul or showed you the shopping before I did the haul. I'm not quite sure what, I, what I'm gonna do here. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing here um, or maybe this is gonna be the intro I'm not quite sure but anyway welcome to simply blessed crafts and if you're new here thank you for joining me and if this is content that you like to enjoy great I'm glad you're here and if you're new to my channel I'm so happy you decided to join us for today I am just rolling with the punches. It's been a long time since I did one of these videos. And I decided, me, me and my cousin decided we were going to go shopping today. And I don't get out much anymore. Um, uh, I'm a little heavy. And honestly, it's a little hard for me sometimes to get around the store. Hard breathing, you know, that kind of thing. If you are overweight, you kind of understand. And I have described that in a past video, and if you want to know some of my health issues, you can go back and look at that video. I can also link that in the description below if you really want to go there. It's back in Christmas stuff, but 
we'll get into that. And if that bothers you, then this isn't the channel for you and you probably just need to leave. But anyway, we're not going to get into that because that's not what this is about. This is about a thrift haul and this is what I'm going to do for you. So whether I showed you the shopping version before this or whether I am going to do the haul version before this, let's get into this. So we'll start off with this. I picked this up and I probably am not going to keep this the way it is because the whole point of me picking stuff up as a thrift store is for me to be able to craft with it. That's usually the point in it. I don't usually pick stuff up to resell it. I can, but that's usually not me. Um, but right now it says friends are welcome, relatives by appointment. And I do have some relatives that definitely could be by appointment. I do think it's cute as is, but I go to the thrift store because wood is cheaper and easy to redo. Um, it does have uh, Velcro and stuff on the back and all that mumbo jumbo, how they stuck it on the wall, but that stuff is somewhat easy to get rid of. It looked like it was wholesale $15.99. Um, prior to me buying it, I got it for two bucks in a two buck bin. Um, and I can either sand it off or repaint it and do whatever I want with it. And that's what I like about it. I can go to a thrift store and buy it way cheaper than going to any, uh, hardware store and getting boards and going that route. So... That's why I go to the thrift store. Also on the wood journey. So like I'm going to say, I didn't pick up a whole lot, you guys. I mean, like I said, I there wasn't a whole lot there. Um, I did pick up some things, but... Also on my word, wood journey, I've also picked this up. And it is already made for me. Um, it is a little bird feeder. Um, I probably will give it some new life. I mean, it is fine and dandy all in his own. Um, you can set it outside on a little table and just put some bird feed in there and away you go. All said and done, but I probably will paint this up and everything. Um, granted, if you're going to paint this and set it outside... You're probably going to have to put some polyurethane or something on it so it doesn't weather in the rain and all that stuff. But um, I do like doing a lot of that kind of stuff for out the outside and everything. And it is a big good seller if you ever do like three, uh, uh, flea markets and stuff like that. Um, another thing that would be really cute would be like molds and stuff like that. And I do have some cute molds and stuff that I wouldn't mind putting up here. Um, or something along those lines. Um, I have also done, um, well, I'll kind of give you an idea, actually. I picked something else up at the thrift store. Um, if you're new to my channel, you might have actually seen this in a previous DIY if you're not new to my channel. But I have also done stuff like this in previous DIYs where I've put a um a coffee pot up like this or a teapot or whatever and then um I put a round thing and cut a hole in it to make it look like a birdhouse and stuff um I've done that as well and um you know this might be cute and I might do that as well on this I'm not quite sure but that would be also really cute for me to do with something like this and it's already done for me and it's just waiting for a nice paint job and a little a little DIY um, granted like I said this needs to be cleaned up it's very dirty inside um, it looks like somebody did it for as a planter um, but both of these were only two dollars in the bins 
Um, so yeah. And this is definitely worth more than two bucks at any kind of, I mean, just buying the wood itself would have been way more than that if you would have bought, bought it and put it together yourself. I also thought these were super cute. These are um, faux books. And I am probably going to have to redo these. I thought these were super cute. I mean, they're cute as is, but I might have to put my own spin on these. I mean, the colors are nice, but I'm a little bit more farmhousey and stuff and I might have to I might have to do a couple little paint jobs and stuff. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I like a little more bright colors. And this one, a shout out to Sammy from Unicorn Dust Designs. I don't know why but I had to pick this up because I just saw her do a DIY with this and I couldn't help myself. I might have to just do it just because. I don't know if I'll keep it or not or whatever, but I had to do it. If you guys watch her, which I'm pretty sure majority of you do, if you don't, definitely go check her out. She just did one of these teapots. It's plastic. It's just a little plastic uh, thing to hang on your wall. And it has flowers on it. It's the exact same thing. Hers was painted completely black. And she painted it with some of her DIY paint. Shout out to Sammy. I'm going to have to recreate this in my own style. I do not have the same paint she does. I have some of her DIY paint, granted, but I don't have the same color. So we are going to have to recreate this in our own spin. So yeah. Again, $2 in the bins. I also found no. some really pretty flowers. These, I believe, were also two dollars. This is just a, lam a lavender bundle. Um, yeah. I mean, you can't go wrong with lavender, especially in springtime. Just a cute little bundle of flowers. Had to get those. And the only thing that I paid less for, and it is actually two dollars as well, but I didn't get it in the bins, was a cute little bunny. It's a little ceramic bunny. I had to get him. I might have to do some kind of cement look for him. But he was dollar ninety nine, so he was two dollars as well. It wasn't a big haul, but like I said, there wasn't a whole lot there. They didn't have a whole ton of stuff. Um, a lot of it was, a lot of it was glass stuff in the in the bins, and you guys kind of will see that. I didn't dig a whole lot in the bins. Um, if I had, uh, if I had better, a better back, <laughs> honestly. Um, and was capable of like bending over and like digging in these bins for hours on end, I would have totally probably done it. But uh, like I said, a lot of that stuff on top was all glass and I was not about to dig in all glass stuff. I mean, that's just a disaster waiting to happen. So definitely check out my shopping haul. Um, I will have that 
like I said, either in the beginning of this or in the end, whatever. But definitely check it out. Let me know. Have a good day, guys.